I want to like talk about you know some funny stories of when I was in Uganda, right? Especially the first time I came to Uganda. Um, yo, so I, the first time I came was was that 2021? I think like October 2021, right? That was the first time I, I've ever came to Uganda, right? So I first went to Nairobi, right? I stayed in Nairobi for like a month, and I came to Uganda, right? From Nairobi, and I took the bus, y'all. From Nairobi to Uganda, 16 hour trip, right? Yo, I felt like I was gonna like, oh my God, that was a long ass trip, man. And the thing is, right? I bought like a first, like they advertised like a seat. It was like, it was like first class seat, right? I was like, oh shit, first class, what? You know what I mean? I thought I was about to, you know, have some fine ass Kenyan women, you know, come serve me some champagne on a bus, you know? Like, I thought I was gonna get some, you know, some nice little cheap hot towels, you know? Bro, that thing was, I looked at the seat, right? They looked the same as the seats in the back, man. Like, this is not first class, right? I even told my Ugandan friends, like, hey, you know, I bought a first class seat on the bus. They, they started busting out laughing, like, what? <laughs> They're like, oh, they made it first class just for you. Like, that's your first <laughs> to, to take my money, man. But yeah, you know, that seat was hard as a rock, man. But you know, it's all good, man. Um, but yeah, so I took the bus, right? Um, yo, that bus, it was a scary ride, man. It, it, was, it was overnight, right? Um, cause when it first, like when, when the trip first started, right, it was cool. Like the roads were smooth, man. Once we got to like, we got to the real roads, man, where I was like, ah, 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 ah. and it was pitch black outside. Uh, they had like little roaches on like the curtains crawling, man. I was, I was like, oh my gosh, man. That was a crazy experience, yo. And even like, uh, like there were like some people, right? Like the bus had stopped, right? And some dudes had walked up into, into the bus. And they had like regular, like regular blue jeans, a t-shirt, but they had a big old AK-47 walking into the bus, man. I was like, yo, who are, who are these dudes, man? I guess they're like police officers, right? And they're asking for your passport, man. And I was like, yo, what is this, bro? Like for real, cause like, I, like you know, like when you see officers, right? Like you wanna see a badge, you know, like, I really thought we were, I really thought the bus was being hijacked, to be honest with you, man. Like you see some dude walking in with some big ass gun talking about, hey, give me your passports. I'm like, oh shit. So I, I, get, I gave the dude my passport, man. He started waving it around like, oh, uh, this is a good passport right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, bro, uh, give me my passport back, bro. You know, like, you know, trying to make your target out here. You know, so yeah, man, uh, that's one of the things I didn't like about the trip, man, was the dudes constantly coming like, I mean, they said they're cops. I mean, I, I don't know, man. You know, I, I, I like, you know, me personally, man, I like to see my cops in uniform, bro. So, but, you know, hey, you know, so yeah, so we got to the border, right? You know, uh, you got dudes, you know, asking, hey, man, give me, give me this, you know what I mean? And, you know, oh, they're going to detain you, man. If you don't, you know, take this. Because I went during the coronavirus time, right? I think my test was expired. The little, uh, whatever test, the antigen, whatever it's called, right? And then, like, the dudes, they're trying to scare me at the border. You know, they're like, oh, they're going to detain you. So, look, just give me 50000 you know what I mean? And I'm going to do this, you know, that, 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 that. You know, like, oh, man, come on, dude. Obviously, man, I didn't pay him, man. You know, I stay strong, you know, like. I ain't paying no money. But on the other token, right, it was one cool dude that worked there, right, at the border, man. He kind of took me away from those guys, man, and, like, he helped me, you know, my paperwork and all of that, man. Of course, I, you know, I had to give him a little something, man. Like, uh, shout out to that guy, man. If I see him, man, uh, at the border, I don't think I'm taking a bus again. But, hey, if I ever see him again, man, I got to, you know, give him a big handshake, man, for uh, helping me out, right? We got to Kampala, right, finally, right, in the morning. This guy, right? Cause, Cause, look, I had a friend in uh, Kenya. He hooked me up with this guy in Uganda, right? And he, said, you know, the guy said, "Hey, man, oh, cool, man. I'm, I'm gonna host your friend, man. I'm gonna pick him up from the bus stop." Man, this dude did not pick me up from the bus stop, man. A bunch of excuses. Oh, sorry, bro. Hey, you know what I mean? I'm doing this, doing that. I'm like, oh, okay, man, cool. I was like, man, what should I do, man? I was just take a boda to, you know, your your apartment. I was like, what the hell is a boda? You know what I mean? I was like, you know, and he explained that it was, like, you know, the motorcycle was right. I was like, okay, bro, cool. Yo, so I asked the dude, right? I called one of the border drivers. I was like, hey man, how much uh how much is it taking to this? You know, I think I was staying in Nalia, right? My Airbnb was in Nalia, right? So I asked him how much, man. I think he told me like from the from the MASH bus stop, right? To Nalia, he said like what did he say, like twenty five thousand? It, it was something like that, man. Something that, you know, it wasn't supposed to be, right? Of course, man, how am I supposed to know, right? You know, first time in Uganda by myself, you know. So yeah, hopped on the back, bro. Yo. Bro, on that motorcycle, man, the back of that motorcycle, we were rock. Foo, 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 foo. Yo, almost got a heart attack, bro. Like, that thing was scary as hell, dude. 
Like for real. Even to this day, man, I'm still not used to those boaters, man. Like, cause you know, I, I be seeing dudes like laid out in the street, man. Like, you know, I'm like, man, is he dead, man? You got dudes standing around him. Like, damn, what happened? You know, so yeah, man. Um, I recommend, man, when y'all come to Kampala, maybe like bring a helmet or something, man. You know, if you can like fit it in your bag when you get on those boaters, man. Cause you know, they, it can get real sketchy real quick, man. Like I've had some near, near death experience, man, out of body. You know, when I be on those boaters, especially during the jam, man, they, they get real dangerous, all right? So be careful, all right? But yeah, the first time I got on one, man, yo, man, I stand on a prayer, man. Uh, thank my mom for everything, you know, she did to me. I thank my dad for everything he did for me. Uh, wrote out my will, you know, uh, you know, went in those chopper caskets. Bro, that thing was scary as hell, man. So yeah, but yeah, you know, I finally got to my apartment, right? And it was cool, man. I had a blast, man. I met uh, so many cool people. Um, a pest, shout out to you. You know, you're the uh, one of the people that helped me out. Uh, took me to Akashia Mall. Her friend took me to Akashia Mall, man. I had fun out there. Um, but yeah, but the culture was so different, right? When I, when I came to Uganda, Africa in general, right? So look, don't get mad at me, right? Here's the thing, right? The culture is so different from the United States, right? Out here, like in Uganda, they have like a big like, they have a big touching culture, right? Like women are passing, especially like, you know, the, the little taxi conductors, right? When the women are passing by, they grab their arm, like, hey man. You know, they grab dudes on, hey, 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 come over here, you know, hey, get, get on this, hey. In the US, man, don't be touching people, man. Like, that's, that's, that's a big no-no, right? You go up to some random woman, you grab her arm, man, that's, you know, that's a wrap for you, right? So yeah, that's one of my tips, you know, for, for Ugandans, you know what I mean? Like, Ugandan men especially. When they come out to the United States, bro, just don't don't touch, please. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? It's nothing, you know. I know it's a part of your culture, man, but it's not, you know, like, so yeah, don't do that, all right? Especially dudes, man. Don't be grabbing no dudes' arm, man. Like, you can get, yeah, you know. I, I'm, I'm just letting you know right now, all right? So yeah, uh, so yeah, it's, it's a big, like, touching, grabbing, you know, culture out here, man. And, you know, people are used to it, man, so, you know, it's whatever, right? And the, the one thing I don't like about, uh, about being, uh, when I was in Uganda, right, the one thing I didn't like, People be cutting a lot, man. Like when you're a line, right? So you stand in line, right? We're waiting for us, you know, like whatever, your KFC, right? And then you get some random like Ugandan guy, bro, he's walking in front of you like. You know what I mean? Like, dude, what? Like, where, where'd you come from, you know? And this is both men and women, right? Like, like it, they be cutting a lot, man. Cause thing is like, they leave the line, right? And then they don't tell you nothing. And then all of a sudden they just hop back in front of you, like. You know, like, it's like, you know, like, usually when you leave line, man, you gotta tell them, like, hey, you know what I mean, da 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 And the thing is, they left the line before you came, you know, so you just, this random dude comes up in front of you, like, bro, like, who are you, you know what I mean, like, so yeah, man, that's the one thing I don't like, man, um, in LA, man, you cut somebody in line, like, random like that, man, that's a, that's an instant fade, bro, you know what I mean, and all my LA people, man, you guys know what fade means, man, if you guys don't know me, it means, like, like, fighting, man, like, yeah, don't, don't cut people, man, you know, like, um, so yeah, I'm trying to give you advice too, man. If you, if you ever come out to Los Angeles or whatever, or New York or United States in general, man, don't cut, all right? Don't cut people online, please. You know, they'll walk up to Popeye's fried chicken, man, and just cutting some random dude, man. Like, hey, you know what I mean? I was here. Right, nah, don't do it, man. You know what I mean? It, it can get real ugly real fast, all right? Um, don't do the most, right? Don't be, you know, trying to do this, rushing past people, pushing people out the way, you know what I mean? Just like, Oh, also, uh, standing real close. That's one thing I noticed in uh, Uganda, man. Like, people stand real close to you, man. Like, especially when you're, like, at the ATM or when you're paying, man. Like, you got a dude breathing down your neck, man. Like, bro, like, can you, like, scoot back just a little bit, man? Like, whoa, man. Like, give me some space, you know? So, yeah, you know? Uh, so, yeah, all those things, man. You know what I mean? It kind of, you know. And, you know, these things aren't serious, bro. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's whatever, man. Um, it's just it's just how it is. You know what I mean? It's just how it is. You know, uh... You know, I'm not expecting, you know, America in Africa, bro. You know what I mean? It's all different cultures, different customs, you know? So, yeah, you know, those are the few things that uh, that, that that really, uh, you know, bothered me just a little bit, man. Um, I feel like this video went off. Like, I was talking about coming to Uganda, and now I'm talking about things that bothered me, you know what I mean, when I was when I was over there, man. But, you know, it's all good, man. Hey, man, I had a blast in Uganda, though, man. I met so many nice people out there. Um... Oh my gosh, man. I love you guys so much. I love the people. Um, those little things I talked about, man, it was like little, you know, like, that's whatever, man. You know, it is. at the end of the day, it was, it was like funny to me, man. You know, seeing those things. Um, oh, hold on. Hold on. One more thing, right? Yo, people in Uganda stare a lot, yo. 
they stare, man. Like they look, and even like even people that I was hanging out with in Uganda, even they said it. Like, man, people out here look a lot. You know, like like they never seen a black person. You know what I mean? Like a lot. My bad. They never seen a black person before. You know, they'd be looking like, oh man, oh shoot, another Ugandan. Oh, oh, another Ugandan. I'm like, yo, man, like, you see, you see, like, Ugandans every day, like, what, what you looking at, bro? Like, you know what I mean? Like, but yeah, people were looking a lot, man, especially when I was recording videos out there, like, people were, like, looking like I was, like, you know, some, some type of alien, man, like, just landed, you know what I mean, on my UFO, bro, like, that was crazy, you know? But I don't know, I guess they're just curious, man. I mean, I, I, I don't know what it is, man, people stare a lot. Um... Yeah, staring in the United States, man, usually like, like, especially like dudes, man, like another dude staring at a dude for like a long time, man, he usually means like you're trying to fight, man. Like that's, that's, you know, like when you look at a dude, like you passing by, he's just like, you know what I mean? He's, just, like, he's looking like, man, what's up? You know, what's up? You know what I mean? Like, but out here, you know, it's just, I guess, you know, people just look, you know? Um, hey, but look, I don't mind the women looking at me, though. You know, if you know what I mean? Yeah. Keep looking, woman. You know what I mean? It's all good. Especially when you got the woman, man. I like when you look, all right? It's all good, man. But other dudes, man, nah, man. Don't look at me, man. You know, please. You know? It's all good, man. Quick little glance, man. Hey, what's up, man? You know, what's up? Yeah, you know what I mean? Look away. Go about your business, man. All right? All right, man. So, yeah. I just want to, you know, make that quick video. Um, Yeah, guys. Hey, hey, guys. I got a little speech impediment, man. Uh, that I grew up with a little stutter, you know? You probably noticed by now, but yeah, you know? So, yeah. All right, guys. So, yeah. I'll see you in the next one. All right? Peace out.